Inside a California courtroom, a familiar face, O.J. Simpson doing something we've not seen him do before. Take the stand. The 65-year-old former football star, hair gray, eyes red, voice cracking, hands in shackles, testifying in the hope that he can win a new trial and perhaps his freedom. ABC's Neil Karlinski was there. He has been a beloved celebrity, an accused murderer, and the subject of a nation's racial divide. I'm Paul James Simpson. But we've never heard O.J. Simpson testify as a witness until now. Your voice was pretty loud in the room. My voice is always loud. With one hand free of his handcuffs, a loose, at times humorous, and animated O.J. Simpson spent the day testifying about the bizarre 2007 robbery of his own sports memorabilia that put him behind bars. You weren't intending to steal anybody's hat, though. I don't take it. I got a big head. <laughs> Simpson joked about the lesser details, but his testimony is critical in his bid to get a new trial. His life today includes reading golf magazines and watching TV inside a 6 by 10 foot cell. His life is uh, basically he's working at the gym. He's in charge of the gym. He coached the best, uh, baseball team. But today's testimony is also a first ever glimpse into one of the most polarizing figures in recent history. OJ is doing uh, spectacularly so far. He's hitting all the uh, points that he needs to hit. He comes off as credible. Nearly two decades after the murder trial that would define him, O.J. Simpson's testimony won't answer any old questions. It's just a last ditch attempt at freedom for a man who is rapidly growing old behind bars. Neil Karlinski, ABC News, Las Vegas.